Well, hello and welcome to what amounts to football heaven. It doesn't get a whole lot better than this. The conditions are utopian. The sky is blue and the players are with us for a football match so widely and keenly anticipated. Truly, this is pristine and the uh, level of expectation and excitement is reflected in the smiling faces of the crowd. They know it means so much and they also experience between them a great sense of privilege at uh, being able to attend this most special of games. Truly, this is a capital venue fit for a truly capital club, which Roma, of course, are. Well, there are plenty looking forward to seeing this, a capacity crowd here. Well, on the face of it, Peter, we would appear to have a high-caliber meeting with very little at stake. But then you consider a, a chance for one or two of the fringe players to get a look in, and this becomes a big incentive, it changes the dynamic. So there's plenty at stake for them, which will do no harm to the energy levels and the overall conviction, and hopefully the style of contest. As you can see, we've already started here. Looking cross field, changing the point of attack. Well positioned to make that interception. Pasalic. Zapata. Looks to drop one in. And he's there to clear it. Pasalic. Oh, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. It's not taken him long, and that's going to be a booking. He's having a go. Played it short. Danger averted for now. And here's Zapata. Well, the less said about that pass, the better. Sharawi. Roma can't make any sort of inroad despite all this possession. Vertu tries to get it forward quickly. Atalanta are playing with a pleasing width here, especially that front line. Is it working for you? Um, it's not movement for the sake of it. Um, yes, it is working for me. There's a purpose to, to create space. Zaniolo. Roma still without an attempt on target. Looks to thread it through. El Sharawi. Up for a head. A fine save! Jekyll really must have felt he had the measure of the keeper then, but how wrong he was. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Look at Tari. Coached through there. El Sharawi. Lovely feet. Played into the towering header! Delivery, no joy. 
I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Forward it goes. Getting on for a third of the way through the game. Checo. Plays it out to the wing. Deftly done. Here it is! Has a pop! Goal! Roma! And Roma take the lead! Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front. They really commit forward in numbers, too. It was all very well drilled. Roma draw first blood here. Yeah, this is also a chance to see what happens to their level of concentration from here. Mkhitaryan concedes a free kick for that. Checo. And it's Checo. There too. Hardly anything between the sides, and the score is 1-0. Lovely bit of skill there. There too. This is promising. Has a pop! It's off target and by quite a way. Well, he did get himself into a good position. Something for him to cling to. Hoists it forward. Zapata. It's a good run down the right. Where could this lead? Into the box. It's Muriel. Luis Muriel. He's on a run down the left wing. Oh, nice touch. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. Zapata gives chase. The room. It's Muriel! Oh, taken with style! Deep into first half stoppage time, a crucial goal! Atalanta are certainly a team that knows how to play their football as stylishly as you'll see. Tiki Taka at its very best, and they back it up with goals.
That has... There is the half-time whistle. Well, it has been an even contest, as the scoreline suggests, and it has been more than decent to watch. Roma head into the dressing room after a half in which we've seen two goals, one each, and the game right on edge. Atalanta get the ball rolling for the second period. Roma clearly have been the better side for me. Yeah, I know the score doesn't quite reflect it, but if they go about their game in the, in the same manner as the opening 45 minutes, things really should improve. That's a poor throw that, picked off with relative ease. The road. Josip Ilicic. Chipped through. He's got options out wide. And he's there to hoof it away. Darone. That's clear cut. It's a free kick. Muriel, Ilicic. To throw in. That's the ball in. Smalling with the clearance. Atalanta making a fresh attempt to release someone in behind from back to front. And this is something different. There too. Someone looks like he's in need of protection here. Yeah, and the creator-in-chief is unsurprisingly being treated as a special case now. Played out to the right. The referee's awarded a free kick. Zapata. Darun. Zapata. And they're guilty of lacking inventiveness here. It's all broken down. There too. Mukatari. Now it's Pedro. There too. Look at Tony. And here's Pedro. Oh, that is lovely footwork. And it's fair too. Good challenge. He just stood firm. Got a shot away. That has certainly tested the keeper. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Gets up to head it! Decent attempt, but not quite good enough. And it's played forward. 
Zapata. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Ilicic. And that's left him on the seat of his pants. Atalanta merit full marks for their attitude and application in trying to win this. It means an awful lot, obviously. The room loses his balance and loses the ball. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. Mkhitaryan. Petra. This is intriguing. Next goal critical. It's a very open game and an exciting watch. There are no signs of nerves or, or caginess from either team. This pitch is go for it territory. Chance! Goal! Roma! And they get themselves in front! Well, I think there's a few trying to claim offside, but he looks to have been on. Yeah, he was on. His second of the game, and an eye now for the hat-trick. Well, this is what we've been waiting for. I think the danger for them now is fatigue. I think when the body tires, the mind soon follows. So concentration is key from here. The road. Roma need to hold on for a few more moments. You can get that clear. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue this situation, and it needs to be any time now, really. Can't get the better of his opposite number. Roma certainly don't need to overcommit now. Their priority lies further back. Diawara. Mkhitaryan. Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. Roma have held on. A knife-edge game, a single goal margin, but they have won it. So a dramatic game decided in its very last moments. Well, I just think that determination and persistence has paid off handsomely to, to squeeze the win out of a draw. Sometimes... It comes down to grit and desire and the stubbornness to keep plugging away. And uh, this has been great staying power. So we've reached the end of our coverage for today. Many thanks to Jim Beglin alongside me. And we'll both see you next time.